Need to this was in January. Isabel Martin, at 10 years old, performing her solo routine. But two weeks after, during practice, Isabel fell. We heard like six pops. She broke her femur, and that wasn't it. It's mainly like right here, but on this one. Her doctors found cancer, osteosarcoma. I often think if, if she wasn't dancing, you know, 18, 20 hours a week, then you know, this could have delayed how quickly we found something. It all happened so fast. Isabel finished her first round of chemo, and on the way out of the hospital, they were handed these. We have two masks at home and that's it. And when they handed it to us after her first chemo treatment, they handed it to us and they said, handle these like gold. Her parents quickly noticed the shortage of masks. Yeah, unfortunate timing with coronavirus going on. We just didn't realize that that really meant like, this is all we have. Isabel's mom, um, Christine, posted on social media pleading to the public. There are kids and lots of kids and lots of patients and lots of people with different conditions that actually need these. And there's more people just kind of hoarding them out of fear. Even the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention states, for the general public, CDC does not recommend the use of face masks or respirators. Anywhere you look, they're, they're sold out, they're gone, they're done, there's nothing. These are their only two. And like they were told, handle them like gold. Whatever the path is that's ahead of us, we'll, we'll take it one step at a time. In Dallas, mm -hmm. I'm Tiffany Lee.